while Sumio stayed at the high camp as the radio contact, despite her cracked ribs. Ed wondered if Paula had received the video he had sent down to base camp. Yeah. <laughs> at this altitude, your mind runs in slow motion. You can't sleep, you can't eat. Your brain is starving for oxygen, your body is deteriorating, and your muscles are wasting away. That's why a final 3,000 feet is known as the death zone. I was feeling tense, because in a few hours I was going to set out on the climb of my life. It takes about 12 hours to get from high camp to the summit. You have to start around midnight, so you can get to the top by noon. Eric was going to climb without oxygen, so he started at 11 that night, an hour before the rest of us. At midnight, it was 30 below zero. Araceli, Jamlin, and five Sherpas packed up their oxygen supplies and started for the summit, following Ed's trail. Hey. <laughs> Okay, she's there. She's just 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 on the Everest, there is nothing to breathe. Started something. There is only a third as much oxygen in each breath as the race at sea level. Most climbers need to bottle oxygen here. But they have. The ounce of energy is sucking you on. You just can't get it up here. This is what it must be like now. Harrison. Harrison, go on. She's not she's not afraid to go back there though. Know? She's like give her a shit. Hey, do you think you do? Like this anyway, because he would think Harris is bad handling him. Come on, Harris. He went right for the diaper. I'm so tired in my life. It's okay, baby. Sometimes I want to sit down and just make my breath. Lenny's a tough kid. She goes through, gets a lot more abuse than babies hit. Tell him to sit down. Harrison! Down. I mean, I have problems with her. Down. Harrison, down. Lenny, down, down. As the pain gets worse, I feel that I'm closer to death oh, than I've ever been without passing like, over to the uh, other side. Hi, Yeah, it's too dark, Mike. Yeah. I'm just going to get a shower. 